it's a secret that I don't too much show like full body on here I don't know never really been my thing but we all know I'm a big girl so there's really nothing that I'm hiding honestly and yes if I can show it in every video the vinyl wall <laughs> the vinyl wall will be in the background but anyway so I have a rather large Shein package here um if you have issues uh, with people shopping on Shein, i understand your feelings are valid but as a plus size woman who still wants trendy clothing i'm gonna shop on Shein. uh so i did get a winter wardrobe i think i'm gonna order some more uh a little bit later so if you want to see what i got i can show you just dive right on in so I'm gonna show you the pieces and on the side of the screen somewhere will be um, me trying it on to try to get some things that I probably wouldn't normally wear I got a lot of skirts this time so yeah um, so I guess we could start off with this shirt um, now in the picture it didn't look cropped and just for size referencing i am typically a 3x up top i can wear anywhere in the bottoms between like a extra large all the way up to like a 3x and a size 1820 in pants um it depends on the style really so this is super stretchy i it's probably extremely cropped, which is fine because this is really cute. I like this top and I absolutely positively adore the sleeves. So can't wait to try this on. Um, and I'm just gonna, no rhyme or reason, just gonna grab, go into the box and grab. Um, I did get a few sweaters this time. Ooh, this feels nice actually. Dang, this is, cro oh no. no. So cropped things may not be cropped on me because I am short and I have a short torso. So I got a brown sweater, turtleneck. It is so, the material is not bad at all. Um, oh, be, uh, for the sizing. So with Shein, I do typically um, size up. So if they offer a 4XL in the tops, I get the 4XL um, just because it is an overseas brand um, sometimes their plus sizes may be junior plus size and not like true plus size so I do size up you know no big deal I want it to fit a certain way I want to be comfortable in it and just to save myself the trouble and having to return a bunch of shit I'm gonna size up if it's a little big fine if it's too small I probably end up giving it a Play-Doh's closet. Um, I'm pretty sure we all know that Shein sizing is not consistent. So I could get something in a 3X that's going to be way too big. And get something in a 4X that's going to be absolutely too tight. So, yeah. Um, I also got a cargo skirt. I guess you could say this is cargo. Um, I actually don't hate this. I think I should have sized down though now that I'm looking at it. I did get this in a 4XL. We'll know. We'll try it on. We'll try it on. Um, I want to wear this with like boots and stuff like that. It has like a windbreaker material. I don't hate it. Um, I've also never claimed to be a fashion girly. So typically if I like something, I'll grab it. I find a top with it and some shoes. I, I'm not a fashion girly, okay? whatsoever um let's see what else do we have here oh i bought a leah is it a leotard i bought a 
a one piece. So I didn't necessarily get this to wear as a one piece. I wanted to be able to layer with it. That's why I got the one piece. So I'm curious to see what this looks like on my very um, triangle-esque shape. Um, unless I say otherwise, I did get all of this in a 4XL. But that material felt really, really good. It didn't feel like it'd be see-through at all. Um, I got another sweater. This one is definitely much. Oh no, I got a sweater vest. So I have this like extremely long white blouse and I wanna style it a little bit better than just wearing a button blouse. So I bought a sweater vest so that I could layer and like get some like thigh high boots and wear with thigh high boots. Also, I'm really trying to like tap into my more feminine style. I am a sweatpants, big t-shirts, graphic t-shirts type of chick. I always have been. I've never been the type to like dress up. Um, So the theme of this is going to be a little shocking because it's definitely more girly. But so yeah, I got a sweater vest. So hopefully it fits in my head the way that I want it to. If not, I'll figure something else out for it. Oh, I bought this crew neck, right? And I'm thinking about layering it with... um the leotard or the one the onesie and wearing my air max sneakers so it just says brooklyn um it's blue it's not green i don't know if it's translating blue it looks green on the, that screen but it's blue um i'm pretty nice quality i don't know it doesn't have much stretch to it so we'll see but it's nice it's definitely nice the material just feels a, a hell of a lot better than when I was buying from Shein. Hell, I bought clothes in the summertime that I didn't film and that material was horrible. Or is this a shirt? This is a shirt, wow. That's really cropped. I was not expecting it to be this cropped. Um, it's really nice, it's soft, it's super soft. Um, but it's so short. I don't, why do they crop everything? And to be fair, on the on the pictures, they don't look that cropped. And I don't know, hopefully with my short torso, I'll be able to get away with it. But that's super short. And I think I got like two or three of these. This is another like going out top just to have something to wear. I love this shirt. <laughs> I don't know what it is about this shirt that I love, but like with a skirt, and a see-through, like a bra, it's see-through. So like with a black skirt or something and a black bra, that would be fire. So it's really soft. It seems like it's super stretchy. Yeah, it's ridiculously stretchy. Um, I don't know why I'm doing this now, but yeah. I like the pattern. I really like the pattern. I don't know. I don't care for the neckline, but that's fine. I bought a gray skirt um, with buttons down the middle. She's cute with like a, a little sweater moment and um, it's see-through. So. I probably have to wear some Spanx or something with this. But it's cute. The material is nice. I did get these. They're leggings, but um, with like a cute white top and a uh, throw a coat and some boots, that'd be really freaking cute. That was the idea anyway. So um, if I can style it, I don't. I haven't gotten any winter shoes, so I'm not gonna be able to style it with shoes. But um. I can like maybe throw a coat over it or something to kind of give you an idea of what it is I was thinking it was gonna look like. Another skirt. Oh, I love this skirt. I cannot wait to put this skirt on y'all. I cannot wait to put this skirt on and I hope it fits a little more oversized. Um, I believe these are like A-line skirts and I try to go for more A-line skirts now because of my shape. So I love the material on this. 
Just I saw it on the on the thing, and it has a slit on the side. Is it on both sides? No, just on that one side. It has a slit. So this is the quality of this is so nice. It is see through, but barely. Like you'd have to really be up on me to see, and just wear some Spanx or some panties or something. I don't know. But this is nice. I love the the print, y'all. The print. Okay. Okay. So here's that other shirt, but in gray. I'm really hoping it's not this short on me. I'm gonna be a little upset if it is, but it's not like I don't wear crop tops, so. Um, here's the same like sweater material in gray. It feels so nice, it's so soft. Oh, it's soft and slightly see-through, but again, you shouldn't be looking at clothes anyway. I got a couple more pieces here. I bought a dress, I believe. Don't know how I'm gonna like that. Um, but I bought a dress. I think this is the dress. Um, the girl in the picture had a belt with it. I would have to get a belt because it did not come with the belt. But it does have a split down here. This feels nice and thick. Um, like it would keep me warm. And... Um, it's not see-through. You can't see through that. If I hold it up to the light like this, you can see through it. But like, with it pressed up against my skin, you cannot see through it. The hell is this? I have no idea what this is. Um, I am not a fan of this material it looks warm it's soft as hell it looks like tattered a little bit it's kind of in the same style as the other two but the sleeves are a little bit different the fabric is definitely different um we'll try it on the last item it is a coat it's thin i know it's thin i would say more so we'll pull over but it's kind of like the yeah it's super thin y'all like i wasn't expecting much from this um but it's soft it's soft as hell but it's like another one of the teddy the teddy coats um but in black it's not as heavy as my one from old navy but i think um it should do just fine these are the buttons but it is thin girl so this is more of a like layer it up type of thing um i have a funny feeling the sleeves are gonna be short on me and to be honest i've got super short arms so if the sleeves are short on me we have a problem okay um but i'm about to go try this stuff on so that you guys can see it and then i'll come back and give you all of my thoughts on each piece for this to be my first trial haul, I don't have the best setup, but let's talk about it. So, I liked how most of it fit. Um, I forget how short I am. Like, I'm five, I'm anywhere between five feet and five one. On a good day, I might be five two, right? Um, and please forgive my hair. Like, I was just pulling clothes over my head and stuff. But, um... I forget some days how short I am. So my two biggest disappointments were the two things I was most excited about, which was that black skirt and the cargo skirt. Um, I think the cargo skirt has potential. Hear me out. If I hem it um, and make it shorter, like not touching the floor, um, I think it would be absolutely too cute not to wear. Um, so probably later on in, in another vlog, I will try to like hem that thing. Um, surprisingly enough, my favorite pieces was the onesie, the leotard, and the gray dress. Um, I felt the most, I felt like I had more of a shape in those two pieces because they were hugging me. Now... 
if you have um any suggestions for shapewear that'll be great because i definitely need some good shapewear um i do um uh, have a low hanging belly so that tends to make me super um insecure when i wear certain things it's one of the main reasons why I don't wear jeans because to me it just doesn't look flattering. First, the crop sweaters, I don't hate those. I'm not mad at it. Um, with a good bra and a pullover or something, it's cute. With some cute pants and some cute shoes, not an issue. Most of those would go with a skirt maybe. Um, so yeah, I'm not mad at the, the crop tops. I do wish I could find some sweaters that didn't stop here. Um, the brown one was much longer and I actually liked that one the least. It just didn't look as flattering. I would probably actually tuck that if I wore it. Like, not if, when I wear it. Um, I would probably tuck that. Um, what else? The the uh, white blouse, the white, the white button-up dress and um sweater vest was probably another one of my favorites um because i'm short short things look great on me especially because i have the legs for them so it doesn't make me look frumpy uh my least favorite thing is that coat and i may send that don't get me wrong it's warm as hell like as soon as i put it on i was damn near sweating um but it's just so so loose and like there's no structure to it. It feels absolutely nothing like the one from Old Navy, which I expected. I wasn't expect expecting it to be that. It's almost clingy. Like it's, it was like, I hated it. Um, this is a very bootleg to me trial haul because I don't have the proper setup. So hopefully you could see the pieces well enough. Um, I don't have a standing tripod anymore. It is broken. So I couldn't like stand it up and fully show you the pieces. And I had nowhere in my room to like set the camera up and fully show you the pieces. So I do apologize about that. Um, I'm going to do my best to edit this and get it up. I'm a little nervous. So like I said, be nice in the comments. I know I'm a big girl. I have to look at myself every day in the mirror. Um, I'm trying to make lifestyle changes to minimize some of the big girlness. But I'm not going to shrink myself for anybody anymore. So... If my fat offends you, then this is not the page for you because in all its glory, I'm fat. <laughs> so, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope someone finds it helpful. Um, and if I do some more shopping, maybe I'll do another trial haul and have a better setup next time. So, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in Vlogmas Day 7. Love you. Don't want a lot for Christmas.